how to download Collaborate. Jump to the student portal, put in your student ID and your password. This is going to take you to the main interface where you are going to jump into one of your classes. Go to the left hand side to Collaborate Live Web Conference. Select the class that has a purple little circle next to it and then select Download Blackboard Collaborate Launcher. Download Launcher and select OK. You're going to find that this is going to start downloading. Now through the power of video I'm able to speed this up but this is a really good time to put a wash on, um, do your hair, uh, go for a nice walk, get a cup of tea because this is actually going to in fact take about 30 to 40 minutes. But once it's ready to go we're going to select the file and then select open and we're going to follow the steps. It's preparing to install and then it's going to prompt us on what to do. So we select next and then install. And again through the power of video this is going to speed up but just take approximately about 30 minutes to 40 minutes going through this whole process uh, and I promise you once you've done this once and you've installed it it's not going to take this long in future. And then just hit finish. Once you've done that I always like to check that it's been installed so I go to add and remove programs in my windows bar and I'll go and have a look that it has in fact properly installed in my computer and I just scroll down and there it is I have found it so I'm glad I know that it is ready to go on my computer so uh, your computers may vary whether you're on a PC or a Mac things might look different so what I do now is I go back into my class go to collaborate live web conference find the little purple icon that just means that a class is ready to enter hit the name of the class and then I can simply join room. I don't need to go through the whole process again. It downloads. I simply select that class once. Please don't select join room multiple times. Just that once, wait for it to load and then it's going to go through this verifying application process. Again, this could take about five minutes to ten minutes so just leave that time um, prior to your session to get set up. And then it's going to go through this nice little process here and you're in. So you're ready to start your Collaborate session. Just maximize the window um, and what you're going to do is audio setup. So select the audio setup, um, select your speaker, press play. She's going to talk to you, the lady, and then you press stop. If you could hear her comfortably, just select yes and then select OK. This is where you're going to record your voice. Testing, one, two, three. And then select stop. Testing, one, two, three. And if you can hear yourself clearly, you're good to go and then just select yes. So just follow the prompts and you're literally ready to go. You can do a few things in here. If you want to talk to your teacher, simply select the talk button and go ahead and chat. Um, if you want to do an emoji, there's a few different emojis in there you can select. If you're stepping away um, for a moment, just press this away button. If you'd like to talk, put your hand up and there is yes and no buttons for the simple yes or no answers that your teacher wants to ask you. And then we have our chat box that you can type into as well and that goes into our chat box. To simply exit, you go up to file, and then exit. Now if you missed a session no worries watch a collaborate recording I'm going to take you through how to do that. Go back into your class where you had the session that you may have missed. Jump back into collaborate live web conference head to recordings and if you can't find a specific recording adjust the dates and then select go and as you can see mine is going to pop up with a whole bunch of recordings. I'm going to simply select 
the session I missed. It's going to download. I'm going to select it once and then we're going to go through the same process again. So this process does speed up um, in future and this is all you need to do. In here you're just going to select run and it's going to open up Collaborate for you. Great, so we go through the same process here. You may need to, need to set up uh, audio again if you can't hear anything and then you'll simply select the play button there. Um, if you so choose you can fast forward to certain places so you can re-watch um, playback anything like that um, and again file exit to exit.